Hey guys, CGXTube here today. I am on PC Minecraft and playing on what I like to call the Hive server. And we're gonna play some hide and seek. So this server is just like a, it's a mini game server, kind of. That's the only part I've really explored of it so far. My friend showed it to me the other night. You guys may know him as Swamp Donkey. If you have seen any of my other videos on Minecraft Xbox 360 edition. On here he's Swamp Donkey and I am Deadwin13, that is my username. I'm still trying to figure out all the controls to PC my, oh there's my nice buttocks, my uh, nice wax cheeks, see she's checking me out, she likes it, gets the girls. Just gotta get those European speedos going, and the drool, everyone likes the drool. But yeah I'm Deadwin13 on here, so if you ever see me running around, you know, feel free to say hi, I'm, uh, I'm a pretty nice guy most of the time, but yeah, hide and seek. Hide and seek. I'm sure everyone must have at least heard of what hide and seek is in real life. If not, you gotta go outside and start talking to people. But hide and seek in this game is a little different. Uh, I first kind of heard of this on actually Black Ops 2, a game mode like this. Hello! And... Whoa. And off... What the... I'm in the guy's chat. Okay. Uh, bad, uh, bad language. <laughs> Speedo derp, yes! And so, okay, hide and seek in this game. Uh, yeah, there's a mod on Black Ops 2 that I first heard about this, and then, like, I, yeah, I got to show this last night. I was like, oh, it's kind of like that mod on Black Ops 2. Well, we're going to be put into a map. If I do dash vote here, it'll show me the different maps right there. There's six different ones to choose from, and once enough people are in the game, we're going to get sent to that map. There's going to be seekers and hiders. The hiders get randomly, you, like, you, you get placed as a random block, sort of. And you can run all around the map, and you have to try to find a place to hide. So let's say I got, I'm a crafting table. Um, it'll look just like I am here now with my hand out, but I'll be seen as others as a crafting table. So I have to find a good place where a crafting table might blend in, so people will run past me and not su like uh, not suspect that I'm a human being. <laughs> and uh, if uh, the the seekers, the seekers have a diamond sword and they're trying to kill the hiders. So if they go, wow, that crafting table looks really out of place, they're gonna come and hit me, and I'm gonna die. Once you die, you become a seeker. This is really fun with other people and friends because everyone will be talking to each other and then you see a seeker run by you and it's like oh, 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 and they'll run right by and look at you and they won't see you. So there's a bunch of stuff. Okay, so see, here we go. So in the lower section, you, oh, you can see how everyone's different blocks here. In the lower section of my quick toolbar, you can see there's a beacon with five seconds next to it. So I am a beacon. That's my block. That's what I kind of look like right now. But the five seconds, that is, uh, you pretty much, you can become a stationary block. So I'm going to try to hardcore parkour it up here. And where can I blend in nice? All right. I'm going to try to get to that area over there. So I showed you what that other guy looked like. That's what I'm going to look like when I'm a stationary block. I can tell you now. That right there, that guy where my crosshairs are, that isn't a person. I've played this map enough where I know who's, like, I kind of know really good hiding places. And I know that is a person. So now uh, if you're paying attention, if you want to rewind my, it says I'm a solid block, but my beacon in the lower right. Oh, see, there goes a the guy. <laughs> see, he knew he was a, <laughs> he knew he was a hider. That's the seeker right there. And he just killed that guy hiding. And let's see, we're just gonna let him go right by us here. Yep, keep going, buddy, keep going. Okay, we're good. So I'm a solid block now. I look exactly like that beacon and that beacon and that beacon. I chose this spot because people may not kind of go up here and because there's a lot of beacons around. And we'll probably, this is a really good like high traffic area, so we'll probably see a lot of people run around here, but I'm a solid block. As you can see in the bottom right hand corner of my quick toolbar, my beacon is glowing. That means no matter how much I look around, my block is not going to move. And I look like a person, but like, they can't see my fist or anything, all that stuff. 
this wooden sword we got, after a certain amount of time, the hiders get a wooden sword with high knockback. Let's see. And oh yeah, how do you like my hat? And so, and uh, yeah, so you get a not, hey, I was trying to think of a sperm joke right there, but nothing came to mind. But yeah, so I get a knockback one wooden sword. So if a guy is coming at me and I think he knows that I'm a hider and I'm not uh, not supposed to be here, I can hit him and then book it like hell out of here and try to get a new hiding spot before he kills me. So it's uh, just kind of like a little last hoorah. And let's see, there's a seeker. They're not uh, they're not doing so good. There's three seekers. If you look towards the right of the screen, there's a. Uh, 20 hiders and 3 seekers and there's also a seconds timer so we have 150 seconds which is like eh, two and a half minutes we have left to hide the seekers they're trying to kill everyone before that time runs out and if the, they don't kill all uh, yeah wait that just messed no I didn't. yeah so you're trying to kill everyone before the time comes up or they're trying to find everyone and the hiders, if we survive, we get a bunch of tokens at the end of the game. Tokens, you can buy different upgrades. Right now, I think this is kind of a generally new sort of game on the server. Oh, there goes an anvil! <laughs> That's what's so funny about this game. Is sometimes you'll just be sitting there like an anvil or crafting table. <laughs> we'll just go flying by you and then a bunch of seekers following right behind him. Oh, there goes another <laughs> Oh, he's going to hide right there. Oh, he's floating, though. He doesn't realize he's floating. Oh, my God, he didn't notice him. Oh, there we go. So, see, he just went from a person to, like, a solid block. That's a, So, that anvil over there is actually someone. And, uh, let's see. I'll do nice... Oops. Move. Anvil, yeah. But yeah, so tokens you can use, you can, uh, there's one upgrade you can buy where you can choose the block you want to be. So if I spawned as a beacon, I didn't want to be a beacon, I could choose something else. Or if I go, ooh, if I, I could go there as a leaf and look really good, I could choose to be a leaf or something. So you can pretty much, you rank up, oh, there's another anvil guy. You can rank up, you can get a bunch of coins to buy rank ups and stuff. And yeah, so there's kind of more reason to play the game other than just having fun, but oh baby, oh no. But so this is a really fun game, just because all the different maps you can choose from, and just uh, just watching people stand in front of you trying not to, trying to figure out if you're a person or not, is just so funny. And sometimes you can be in the most obvious spots and people won't find you. Though we are actually doing really good this game, usually usually the hiders don't win usually the seekers are really good and they can find everybody i'm surprised no one's even come up here yet this is kind of like a 50 50 up here sometimes people will know about this spot sometimes they won't a lot more people are starting to figure out the map but we have 10 seconds to go here and i think we're gonna yeah we're gonna win it 11 hiders left we did really good this round Yay! And so we've received 40 tokens. I have 597 now. But yeah, that is Hide and Seek. This is also my first video on PC Minecraft, I think. It's my first time using Fraps and Sony Vegas, so there might be problems with the video. I apologize now if there are. If you want to see more mini games and stuff, kind of let's plays like this, make sure to let me know, because these are really fun game types. Or if you have any if you know of any mini games that uh, you'd like me to play, also let me know. But uh, yeah, make sure to like and subscribe. Check out my other videos. The IP address for this server will be in the description below. Thanks for watching, guys, and until next time, bye.